What's up everyone, so today I woke up and then all of a sudden I hear a knock on the door So I was like, hmm, who can it possibly be this early in the morning? So if you guys have not already heard, BTS has dropped yet another bombshell at us And just, just stop, I, I can't take these, I thought we were done with theories Like what the, f why? Stop playing these games, big hit, I can't <laughs> No, she, she wasn't ready. Hashtag wings is already trending on Twitter worldwide and people don't know what to do with themselves. Like for me, I'm just digging up my own grave. Like what the fuck? I can't, I can't take, why is this happening to us once again? I mean, I'm just really happy, but at the same time, nothing's going to be answered for a while. You're just going to get a billion more questions. The realms of day and night, two different words coming from two opposite poles mingled during this time. Okay, let's just pause here. The quote you just heard was by Herman Hesse and Demian from The Two Realms. The realms of day and night, two different worlds coming from two opposite poles mingled during this time. Now, I'm not sure if I'm the only one who thought this, but if you guys heard that car screech in the beginning or that car crash, that reminded me of BTS I Need You. Okay, pause here again. Those words are actually lines from Jungkook's part in the song Tomorrow. Now, if you guys notice, there's a parallel between Jin and BTS I Need You and Jungkook here in the short film where their outfits are just exactly the same. There's the white shirt, there's the black shorts. And if you also take notice on their chest, there is also a parallel between Jin having a flower on his chest, whereas there are wings on Jungkook's chest. I swear the moment I saw this and I looked at my Twitter mentions, people were just spamming me this picture of Suga. Look, it's ex exactly the same picture as, oh my god. So a lot of people are speculating who this person is in the painting. To me, it looks like V. I don't know about you, but it just really looks like V to me. But people are saying it could be a combination or I don't, I don't know at this point. It's uh, but I feel like this is how most armies are feeling at this point. Stop it, big kid. My heart cannot take these feels anymore. <laughs> I knew it, Jungkook is the new Red Power Ranger, thank you very much. Shut up, Steven, it's not funny, it's not time for jokes, okay? I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm just- But seriously, I'm just as confused as you are, I don't know what's going on. And once again, I just want to give a big round of applause to Big Hit Entertainment for trolling us all once again. You remember when it said, boy meets what? W-H-A-T, Wings, W, Wings, short film number one. There are going to be three more short films coming with H, a and T and you just better just pack your bags right now and leave because you're never gonna be ready and your mind is gonna be f once again and we don't know when it's gonna drop and uh, why are you doing this big <laughs> Honestly, I think the short film has to do with the book Demian because Ratmon quoted it from the very beginning and there's just so many connections that relate to the book. So I did a little of my own research and found the plot summary and looked up some major themes, motifs, and symbols and it basically summarizes as Emil Sinclair's entire existence can be summarized as a struggle between the two worlds, the world show of illusion and the real world, the world of spiritual truth. In the course of the novel, accompanied and prompted by his mysterious classmate Max Demian, he detaches from and revolts against the superficial ideals of the world of appearances and eventually awakens into a realization of self. 
Deeming is the story of a boy, Emil Sinclair, and his search for himself. Emil was raised in a good traditional home at the turn of the century in the young nation of Germany. His family is rather wealthy and they have a reputation as an upright, godly family. As a boy, Sinclair views the world within the walls of his home as representing all that is good, pure, innocent, and godly. But starting at a young age, he feels a constant inner conflict between this world which he refers to as the world of light and the outside world or forbidden realm which represents sin, loneliness, deceit, and insecurity. And although his mother, father, and two sisters remain within the world of light, he constantly feels drawn to the outside realm and is in this way somewhat estranged from his family and their sphere of security. He ends up vacillating between both both and not belonging to either. Pretty important to note that the symbol of the sparrow hawk has a lot to do with this story. The bird represents a desire to break free to be independent symbolically since the bird appears on Sinclair's childhood house, it shows that this yearning has been with Sinclair from the very beginning. Later, the sparrow appears much brighter, illuminated. This indicates that Sinclair has reached within himself to activate the part of him that longs to be set free. If you guys enjoyed this video, then don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Follow me on all my social media at Steven Dang at Twitter, Instagram, and Snapchat to get updated on these BTS theories. I love it. People are going nuts. So yeah, I make new videos every week. So subscribe and I'll see you guys next video. Bye. <laughs> Another one, my turn, eh? Singer, that's a leak, eh? Turn, no, boy,